yesterday Miguel presented to us dangerous jobs. He presented the police in uh, Michoacan, I think it was, okay? That is a dangerous job. And this is page 78. So today we're going to identify the topic in the text. That's our um, assignment for today. Uh, first of all, look at the photos. Would you like to do these jobs? Why or why not? We have two pictures here. We have a girl and her head is inside of a crocodile's mouth. And then we have this man. He's on a ladder. You can't see it much, but he is cleaning windows. Those are dangerous jobs. So the question is, would you like or would you? Would you like to do these jobs? Yes or no? So let's read and then you will tell me. Then we have to read the tips in the how-to box. The how-to box is here, sorry. The topic of a paragraph is usually in the first sentence. So what we do here is we read this topic sentence carefully. And um, the other way is to identify important words in the topic sentences to see which is the topic. We have to, so this is the topic to read it first, we read the tips. So first of all, we're going to read the topic and then um, try to do the match between, choose a topic that matches each section. Here we have the world's most dangerous jobs about the show. This series look at some of the world's most dangerous jobs, pilots, war journalists, fishermen, even taxi drivers, and construction engineers put their lives in danger every working day. So these are very dangerous jobs, okay? You have a lot, but there's a lot more. In each show, we'll follow two brave people with hard jobs. So this is about the show. <clears throat> in this show about this show james first paragraph says cleaning windows isn't an easy job but for james it can be a life or death task james is an extreme window cleaner and cleans tall office buildings up to 30 floors high we have seen people here in panama clean those windows it's a very dangerous job, okay? Not everyone can do this job. You don't have to be Spider-Man, but you can't be scared of heights. James had to have a special training and he uses a lot of safety equipment. He looks like a mountain climber not a window cleaner because he has to put on a lot of straps to be safe okay and tie himself up strong winds or rain can be very dangerous when you are on the outside of a skyscraper skyscraper are those super tall buildings okay james regularly checks the weather and his equipment he knows that if he falls, he'll die. We follow him on a typical day. So this is a report about James and his work. His clean, he cleans windows. So we're going to identify the topic and do that work now. The next one, Mali. Mali. Training wild animal is never boring. So we see the topic there. She trains wild animal. 
Molly knows that she's a crocodile trainer at a zoo in Thailand. Her job is to train crocodiles in shows for tourists. Personality is important if you want to be an animal trainer. You must be patient and very brave. Mali didn't have to take any exams for this job, okay? But she has to know how to, how crocodiles behave. It's a very dangerous. She's putting her head inside a crocodile's head. She also has to know how to react quickly. So let's say if the crocodile attacks her, what to do? Okay, she has to know. Every day, Mali risks her life to entertain tourists. In the show, she puts her arm, her arm, this is her arm, okay, in the mouth of a crocodile or she lies her head in its mouth like she has it here. The crocodiles are four to five meters long and their teeth are huge. Will Mali always be lucky? So these are two of what the world's most dangerous jobs, okay? That we are seeing. So now we're going to identify the topic and in each one of the paragraphs. Okay, so we completed this part and um, we identified what in the first paragraph we identified is explains what the job is and uh, what it's like in James cleaning windows and for Mali same thing in the first paragraph they both explain what the job is and what it's like that is D option D then we saw we read the second paragraph the par second paragraph explains um, the what you need for the job that is our option C and we choose both of them are explained in the second paragraph we have it here okay in the the case for James he had to have a special training he must you if you um, are scared of heights you cannot uh, work here of course as a cleaner a window cleaner and he also uses a lot of equipment so that is in the James case and in uh, Mali's case she has to know how to manage crocodiles how they behave she didn't have to do an exam but she has to know how crocodiles behave and how to react quickly so that was uh, each one and then in the last one we have the dangers that each job supposes in, in the case James cases strong winds or rain that can be very dangerous and Mali that she risks her life every day to, then she puts her arm or she puts her her head in a crocodile's mouth so that's quite dangerous so we identified each one we finished this part of our reading